In this video we're going to create this part called the vertical stabilizer. I can see that it has a rounded top edge at 0.5 or a diameter of 1 inch. And from the center point of that rounded edge it uh, has a vertical height of 0.75 and a width of 1.5. This is a 0.25 or quarter inch thick part. I'll start a new part studio in inches. Click on sketch and use the right sketch plane. Right click and view normal. I'm going to start with a center point circle. Click on the origin to establish the center and this has a radius of 0.5 or a diameter of 1. And with that set I'll use my line tool and I want to be tangent to this outside edge. Now I can use the center, horizontal line, and coincident will create a tangent point there. This is going to be a vertical line. I'll click and set the distance at 0.75 for the length of that line. Uh, it's going to be horizontal coming to the left. I'll click again and this is 1.5 for a horizontal distance. And now I have a line that goes from the end point and it needs to be coincident and tangent to the circle. I can see both of those uh, icons showing up, so I'll click the mouse and end that. And so that creates my profile. I'll accept it. I'm going to hit P to turn off the sketch planes and choose isometric. We'll extrude. I'm just going to use a window to choose that profile. It has a, a depth or thickness of 0.25. That looks right, so I'll accept that. And I've created my vertical stabilizer.